engineer that's on call. So Lexmark now has a telework initiative for engineers to work from home. So you can see that video is really changing how these organizations run their business now. So in a summary, if this represents a typical manufacturer in the center with the suppliers and support departments around the periphery, it's very common for companies to get involved in video with typical room systems, as you all know, and then move to some desktop systems for some executive staff or finance groups. But then once that infrastructure is in, it becomes very easy for them to extend that video network into the manufacturing floor. Interns are very commonly used on the factory floor. We actually sell more interns on factory floors than we do in hospitals now. Um, the the um, tactical is used in, in um, outside environments, ruggedized environments. Uh, for instance, some companies, uh, process companies, are using that for pipeline maintenance. Then it extends the field view is a highly portable device that's very often used in service and maintenance, also in supply chain management. And then video might extend to more uh, individuals in the corporation. And when that happens, the ad hoc, uh, the number of ad hoc calls go up significantly. And then the power of video actually becomes much more significant with ROIs increasing as the number of units deployed increase. So this is a ad that I thought I would uh, end with that talks about uh, troubleshooting and supply chain. Which process would you like? Process one, which requires flying out to the uh, problem site and resolving the issue and then flying back or process two. So you can see there's a tremendous amount of waste eliminated in process two. The common products that are used in these applications, again, are the intern and field view together. And the emphasis here is that this is collaboration often over objects. It's not so much person to person, although obviously there's two individuals on in the end of the call. But the real object of focus is whatever the technical issue is that they're resolving. So they're going to want to look at that issue and see it in context to what has created that problem. So I wanted to give you that quick overview. Um, if you have any questions, uh, please give me a call. Again, my background, I've managed manufacturing plants for over 25 years. I know what these pain points are that the, your customers might be dealing with. So I wanted to give you that quick overview and good selling. Thank you very much.